The standard iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus will be equipped with frosted back glass like existing Pro models, according to a Weibo post last week from the same account that accurately leaked that iPhone 14 models would be launching in yellow. So hey everyone, I am Ayush and if you are new here, don't be shy, do subscribe now. With frosted glass, the iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Plus would look more similar to the Pro models. However, only the iPhone 15 Pro models are rumored to be getting a new titanium frame and even thinner bezels around the display, whereas the standard models are still expected to have an aluminum frame and the same bezel size. The rear glass panel on the iPhone 14 and iPhone 14 Plus is officially removable for the first time since the iPhone 4S, making internal repairs easier. It's unlikely that a switch to frosted glass would impact this design aspect. Over the years, it's become a common practice for features and design elements that were once exclusive to Pro models to eventually make their way down to lower-end iPhone models. For instance, OLED displays were previously only available on Pro models, but became a feature on the entire iPhone 12 lineup. This year, it's expected that the Dynamic Island will be expanded to the entire iPhone 15 lineup. This is the first time we've heard anything about a green option for the iPhone 15. Previous rumors related to iPhone 15 colors suggested that Apple was considering light blue and pink options for its standard models. Meanwhile, the iPhone 15 Pro models have been tipped to include a dark red version. In recent years, Apple has featured five colors for the standard iPhone and four options for the Pro models. You'd have to assume that Midnight and Starlight, that's black and white to you commoners, are going to return for the iPhone 15, as well the product, red variant. That leaves two potential color slots and three rumored colors, light blue, pink and now that cyan green option. While the source of this rumor accurately leaked that the iPhone 14 would launch in yellow a few months in advance, they do not have a long-term established track record, so there is no guarantee that their latest information will prove to be correct. Nevertheless, the source's accuracy in the past makes this rumor worth sharing. Finally, what are your thoughts about it, do let us know in the comments section, hope you liked and subscribed to this channel, I will see you in next one.